One more, sorry, one more, that was me. Yeah, brilliant, thank you very much. I'd never heard of Perford. My wife um, was brought up in Rowtown, so she knew it very well and had friends here when she was at school. But we'd both moved. She was living in Buckinghamshire, I was living in East Sussex, and uh, we decided to meet somewhere in the middle. Um, jo asked me to meet her here, and I remember coming off the M25, A3, into Ripley High Street, and you think, oh, this is, this is quite nice, I quite like this. And then you do that right into that very strange and bizarre, almost single track, but not quite. You can get two vans down there if you don't mind clinking mirrors. Uh, we came up the hill to St Nick's, and um, uh, where we got married five years ago last week, and turned right into Perford. And Jo showed me round... Um, all of Perford that day and I had no argument at all. I thought it was absolutely gorgeous. Brilliant, brilliant. Um, so I've been a professional photographer for over 35 years. Um, the, one, of the, one of the draws to it was the fact that um, I mainly photograph people. Lovely, beautiful, thank you. So I think the one thing that sets Perford apart is it's not a destination village. It doesn't have a gourmet pub, it doesn't have a restaurant, it doesn't have a huge coffee shop. So people aren't coming here and passing through. People are living here and, and leaving to go and do that sort of thing elsewhere. And I think that gives that sense of community.